summer concerts. As you can tell by your Facebook and Twitter feed, summer music festivals are upon us. So if you're willing to embrace the toxic porter potties and pseudo hipsters, we'll show you which one is hardcore enough for you. Guys? If you like EDM and don't mind the pill-swigging zombies that have been awake for 72 hours straight, check out the Electric Daisy Carnival. Tiesto, Avicii, Calvin Harris, and a lot of neon everywhere. It's like stepping inside a drug rainbow where slutty rave chick leprechauns are searching for their pot of gold. Hardcore level, 6 out of 10. Not into EDM? NYC's Governor's Ball has acts like Outkast, Phoenix, Rain, Lightning, Tropical Storms. Yeah, those last few aren't bands. Put on your fucking ponchos, kids, because this festival's usually drowning in flash flood warnings and hipster mud fights. Hope you survive. Hardcore level, 7 out of 10. I'm just gonna pay. With a name that sounds like the Native American word for ridiculous, Bonnaroo is like the UN of music. Opposites like Elton John and Kanye West share a stage. Warning, you will need to survive four whole days in scorching Tennessee heat. For the love of all things holy, don't forget your deodorant. <laughs> Forget about showers, because you'll be living out of a straight-out tent for four days. So it may be a good idea to invite that not-so-cool Eagle Scout friend of yours you haven't talked to in. Brian! Uh, Want to go to a concert? Hardcore level, 9 out of 10. Last, but certainly not youngest, is Punk Lovers Warped Tour. Half pipes filled with Hot Topic aficionados, angry lyrics, and your dad. Yup, parents can in free so they can chaperone your ass. Hardcore level, 3 out of 10. Sorry, dad. So pack up your water bottles and glow sticks, people, because these memories are not going to make themselves.